I think it's great to see uh, so many entrepreneurial women who are starting their own businesses and growing them. And certainly my advice to young women out there maybe listening to this, figure out what makes you unique. Think about the, 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 the value and the, the attributes that, as a female, uh, are really, really important. And, and don't shy away from those. I mean, right. bring those to the workplace because they're certainly needed, whether it's in a leadership capacity or a strategic capacity. I think. Again, you will be embraced and you will be welcomed um, because that um, more and more, I think we are seeing uh, the value of that. I remember early on, I got involved in, in an association in our state, in the state of Iowa, and mm -hmm. I, I became the first woman to chair that in 90 some years. And I remember one of the other guys on the, on the executive committee saying, well, Mary, you know, what I really like about you is you talk like a guy. Yeah. You know, and the point was right. that probably, that is more my style. Mm -hmm. I'm more kind of to the point, pretty task oriented, mm -hmm. may, maybe more so than, than a lot of uh, other woman, women might be. Mm -hmm. but, but that was also just who I was. And mm -hmm. so f for me, I have really always just tried to encourage women, young women and women of all ages to be themselves yeah. and to, to be the best they can be. There was a great sense in the corporate culture that um, for me to be successful, I needed to take on more male traits, more male characteristics. And in fact, there were even workshops, um, very subtly uh, crafted, uh, that would help women mm -hmm. um, kind of pick up on and adopt, uh, adapt to some of those male uh, traits and characteristics. Mm -hmm. Certainly, it has evolved, thank goodness, over the years. Women are now, I think people have really kind of come full circle and they realize the value that women have, not only as leaders, but as marketers, as people who perceive and develop uh, products. I mean, many of the consumers, many of the purchasers are women. And so um, I think there's real hope uh, in today, certainly uh, compared to the way it was when I started out. There was now this kind of willingness to kind of value uh, both men and women, and not to make one like the other, um, but to, to actually celebrate and encourage the differences, because that's where the real strategic advantage was for the, for the company. Uh, and I think in, culturally, as women continue to progress, their education levels increase, their uh, earning potential increases, more and more companies are realizing that they need key women in key positions in companies to help them reach the profile, the, the, the demographic that largely is out there spending and, and buying. So I'm optimistic. I'm very optimistic.